They split the foul line on this. Split the foul line. And ready? It's real simple. We're going to slap hands. X is going to touch the baseline. O is going to touch half court. And then they're going to come in transition. Coach, player, manager, you can give the ball up whenever you want. You want to see your defense react. Where's your pickup point? And they get to play. So they get to play, and it's that simple. Slap and go. And now you're all thinking the same thing that I'm thinking. Is this competitive? Yeah, keep keep track today of your stops. When can the coach give it up? Whenever he wants. If this is two big guys and you want this big guy to run that floor and post up, run the floor and post up, enter the ball. If you have somebody that want, you want to work on their skills, throw it to them as they touch half court. Now make them dribble into a one-on-one. -on -one. And now evolve it. Well, if that last drill was twice, why couldn't this be twice? No, it's twice. So it's slap and go twice. They slap, they go, they make a play. And now, so we're processing their thinking. The O now has to touch a baseline. Does it have to be underneath the basket? No. Can it be out here? Yeah, it could be any. You touch a baseline, X, you touch half court, and we're playing again. How long? Four minutes. How do I keep score? How do you want to keep score? Stops or scores? So you've just done eight minutes of practice. You've worked on your layups, your directions, your listening, your conditioning, and you've played one-on-one. -on -one. one of the beauties of that way of starting practice is that every kid in your program, every kid in your gym has touched the ball. Do you ever assess your practice and say, man, that, I, don't, I don't know what he did today. Well, guess what? So do they. They assess it that way. And if you haven't touched the ball, if you haven't gotten your juices flowing, you go home like, you know what? That was like algebra two. I didn't know what the hell they were talking about in, that, in, in there. Okay. Let them touch it. Let them feel it.